So, great library. And we're looking for an item that I don't really know what we're looking for. Ancient dust. This is too easy. Okay, the area isn't that big. I was simply expecting something a bit more. Alright, crew. Let's take them down. I got blinded. It's nice, all right, guys. Has poetry of dagged fields. City of shadows. Temple of wind. Rites and rituals. I've already read this. Yeah, this is nothing new. What do you want? What is that? Dust elemental. Oh shit. Just follow me. There's more with that. All right, crew. Consider it done. Let's take them down. Take it down. Fuck. And I'm dead. Um. Things happen. I'm inclined to dump our uh, companion Xanos, really. Now just wait right there. Because it looks like a lot of trouble to try to fight through everything. I say. <laughs> That's it. We are gonna have to do something about him. This is too easy. What is it doing? I need it to move.
part of resurrection. Okay. Yep, 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 yep. Quite sure how you're supposed to deal with all this. Beggar's love. So. Thou covers the pages of this unassuming romance novel. It is lovingly illustrated, though the inks have dealt with age. I read the novel and this happened. Hi there. Jendra, sweet Jendra, you are gone. Betrayed by kin and clan, and I, your William. I can do nothing more for you than weep. O oh, gods, thy names are cruelty and injustice. You know how to find the wise wind. The wise wind? I have heard the name, though I know not where. But what use have you for a beggar such as me? I am blind and lame and with a broken heart, besides. Please leave me to my sorrows. What happened? How can I help? On learning of our love, her stepmother sent her to that monastery across the way. An ill wind comes from it, though. I can smell it on the air. I fear for her. Can you not charge to her rescue? Oh, that I were a knight and had the means to do so. Alas, since birth the gods have cursed me with eyes that cannot see, and a twisted leg that leaves me lay. It is enough I have made it this far without dying heartbroken, blind and lonely, within the depths of some crevice. Oh, sweet Jendra, this world is a tragedy for us both. Goodbye, William. Go. I pray you live a happier, less accursed life than mine. Yeah, whatever. Bones. Really? I know it's armor. It should be better than what we have. Although we have damage resistance in here, so that may be not may not be the case. Yeah, this is a uh, plus five armor, plus five. Right. So it has better armor class by three. Does not have any damage resistance. Don't know which is better. I guess it depends on the circumstances. The thing is, the armor class we have is still low enough that we're gonna take hits. So it might be better to be able to mitigate the damage rather than to have them have them hit a few hits less. I don't know. Could go either way. I suppose it depends on the opponents. Intruders, come, sisters. They must not. We. They must not let them interfere with the ritual. Okay. No, the priests. <laughs> All right, crew. Let's take it Kendra is dead. Grand matron. 
the devil. Not sure what I'm supposed to do here. Yeah, they are slaughtering me. Like, not even a contest. Why am I attacking? able to really handle this. I'm quite sure what the game wants me to do. But we're just getting slaughtered here. The situation isn't that bad. This isn't a joke, these guys are tough. this no mm, we're fucked come on Uh, I need to find out what the hell do I need to do here. Do I actually have to kill these or can I just move past and get out with things? Yeah, well, I need a key. Does this skeleton spot us so easily when no one else does? Okay, let me take a guess. The matron is the one with the, with the key.
We dumped uh, quite a bit of damage on her. And we're pretty much dead for it. Yeah, we can certainly do a lot better. I haven't really used any of the boosts here either. Sweet, sweet shadow dancer. <laughs> Fight that was already lost, trivially easy to turn around. Pin and a dagger. I'm very curious about the daggers. I have a couple of these already. You know, we didn't make it in time. You have come. The dagger could be a much better weapon than the rapier I just bought, so... Happy Happy Joy Joy. Waste of money. What is the goddamn ring? Ice Talon. Plus two enchantment with uh, extra ice damage. That alone is better. It's simply how we get our damage from. So the base damage is nice, but certain other things are more high, highly valued. What about the other one? Courtesan Blade. Plus two enchantment, keen, and on hit stun. 50% chance, DC 14. So. Um. Both very good, actually. I think I like the one with the elemental damage more for now. The stun is incredibly useful, but it's a... Uh, not now. There's no use for the Ice Blade though. The Ice Talon is much better. Now just wait right there. Yeah, and wait while I'll talk to these guys. Till I say. <laughs> This is too easy. Oh, they're good. Move it. Move it. Move it. Why don't they lose me at any point? Oh, we almost got the priestess. Jesus Christ. There's more where that came from. Stun! That's good. It means all follow up attacks are sneak attacks. So. Shit. 
Come on, lose me, you son of a bitch. I think we already got what we wanted from here. Definitely so. What was that? Terrible, terrible uh, attack rolls. And they're very lucky in the counters he got. I can easily lose this survive fight fairly. I only have a little bit of left on my defenses. Okay. This is more of a, I guess, a warm up for us. Sooner or later, we're gonna get into a lot of tough fights. And All right, crew. Let's take them down. Tough fights where we have to get a victory out of it, no matter what. No running away, no nothing. So we practice for that. What do you want? What do you On the nature of hell. Read the treaties. So we're jumping from book, book to book. It's an arch wizard there. I'm not sure of the name. Edward's Black Tentacles, something around like that. There, that's a very annoying spell. But there, it's actually very easy to evade them. However, you have to be aware that they're gonna be coming away. Goddamn succubi are gonna dump the ton, a ton of those. Now just wait. Each and every right one of them will there. throw at least one of that. Don't so, there's gonna be a huge mass of that spell at some point. It's an absolute catastrophe on that point. Yeah, we don't want to stand, stand there. They'll kill themselves too with that. Uh, I'm dead. Didn't manage to evade it. So, yep. Yeah. The paralyze hits you, it's game over. Uh, I don't have the resistances against the tentacles, and I don't have a lot of life, so. It also doesn't do elemental damage, so that doesn't help us. Now just wait right there and don't I think it's a summoning spell, so your really resistances don't matter all that much. I think we're gonna let them fight each other for a while. I'm sure the mage is safe. Your soul shall be 
Clisanos don't come here. And I'm fucking dazed for how many minutes again? No idea. I, I can't fight anyone in days mode. I can walk, but I can't attack. He's not immune to level drain, I am, that's the problem. I have no way to really recover that. It's one big cluster fuck now. Come on, take them out. It's only four of them. We only need to get a little bit lucky and we can even stun one of them. At that point it's game over for him. Although that uh, certainly applies to me too. At this level, if someone stuns you in a fight, it's, it's over. Nim's cloak plus five. That's not a cheap cloak. Might be able to get enough money from that to restock our healing supplies. Greetings. So you come to torment me for my crime, have you? You have come to speak upon the once great Carsis and write my name with the uh, within the annals of infamy. I've seen your type before. Do you know how I might find the wise wind? Ah, you are the seeker of the windness. Long has it been since I set foot upon fair undertide. Lost now, all lost and broken, but yes, the wise wind. If you seek it, then you already carry it. Not in your pocket, but in your mind, your heart, your soul. You need but write it down to make it real. What were your crimes? Crimes? No, no. There was only ever that one. You, Pris, arrogance, madness, call it what you will. I simply wanted to be one with the magic. And for a single moment, I was. I cast a spell of such power that I saw the souls of the soul of the world. But like the woman who spies an unwanted suitor at her window, she cast this one's great curses out. She cast us all out, all the arch wizard of Netheril, all our precious mythos, all our floating cities. What do you mean she casts you out? Magic flows like a river from the soul of the world. 
If the soul of the world damns that flow, those of us down river must suddenly do without. For but a few minutes in all of history of the world, there was no magic. So that is why the cities fell? It is indeed. It is why so many great works suddenly fail. Because of my loss to see the soul of the world, hundreds of thousands perished. Those who had extended their life through magic withered within moments. Netheril's great floating cities fell and shattered every one. What has been your punishment? I've suffered in the hells for 10,000 years or more. Only the merest portion of, mo of the eternity I owe. The succubi come to tempt me, but I spurn them. The very hounds of hell nip at my heels, but I struck them off. For worst of all are my own memories, yet I dare not let them fade. To forget the fallen is to kill them twice. No, I have mixed an ink of ash and my own blood, and with it written my confession, every ounce of it the truth. May I read it? No, I'm carrying far too much useless garbage. I'm going to have to dump some of this. Yes, it is done now. After countless years of endless turmoil, it is complete. Here, take what remains of the ink. My blood in it will let you pass the gate. Read it and tell the world uh, that I'm sorry. What exactly did I get? Inkwell. What looks like an inkwell? And drop some weights. Rotten bow. Crater amulet of health. Well, that's convenient. That's uh, regeneration. You for the regeneration. You don't really need that to make much of a difference. You get the amulet of health. It has the benefit that now he won't be vulnerable to a lot of the status effects, things like that, that have been plaguing him for quite a bit while now. So, good for us. And I got the regeneration. It's not good enough to survive on that regeneration bone, but it help. I don't think it's even one point per second, something a bit, a bit slower than that. bit of a downside. Sneaking in wasn't that hard. Get out might be. Please do something. I, I can't do anything. I literally cannot do anything.
I use the No, it's impossible. This would have been so much easier without Thanos. Now he's just he's never not gonna go away. This is too It's not giving up on me. Ah, we'll have to do it this the old fashioned way, kill all the things. Those smithies are actually the bigger problem. This is too easy. Uh, with their support, the dust elementals, the big green guys, uh, can basically just pummel at us without any interruptions. This is too easy. <gasps> See the saving throw. Hmm, I don't think they can be stunned. Take more damage. God damn the nose. Only one end to this, you know it. You can delay it, but you're all going to go down just the same. There's nothing you can do about it. This is too easy. In a way, it is, but you have Shadow Dancer has weaknesses, and just because you can hide yourself from certain enemies without too much fuss, does not mean you're somehow totally invulnerable against all damage, all trouble. And a lot of other classes could handle this situation much faster than the Shadow Dancer. 
wouldn't, there would have not have been need to hide. So it's not like the Shadow Ganser is somehow amazingly overpowered. It's a good, good combination of skills, so works very well. Important level up. More rogue. I wonder are the others equally tough? Might want to ooh, see specific feats. Defensive role. The rogue is struck by a potentially lethal blow. They have a reflex saving throw. If if, su if successful, they take only half damage from the blow. They okay, improve evasion. When reflex save is allowed for half damage, character with this feat instead takes no damage if they succeed at the save. Even if they fail, they take only half damage. So, mm, very good. Crippling strike. Rogue deals an additional 2 points of ability score or strength damage when they make a successful sneak attack. Not bad at all. Does it accumulate? Opportunist. The rogue gains plus 4 components bonus to attack rolls when making attacks of opportunity. The opportunist improved evasion, crippling strike, all nice. Skill mastery. When using disable trap, open lock, set trap skills, the character automatically takes 20 on any skill check, even if in combat. Slippery mind. Failing their will save versus mind affecting spells gets an automatic refall. Um, we can use a uh, ability to block mind affecting abilities. That's not a problem. Offensive role would be great against mages, any kind of mage type ability. Either you take zero damage or you take half damage. You cannot take full damage anymore, it's just not possible. Rippling strike, yeah that's nice, but I think I'll take improved evasion. Mm, yes. Xanos, are you any better now? Uh, well, he has about 200 hit points, so that's something. But yeah, I'd like to finish at least the library. Get the wise win out of here. With the rest, I don't, I don't know. It, it sort of seems like the Xanos is just an anchor at this point that I'm dragging around. He's just delaying things. Okay, the empty tome. The ink that once covered these pages is all but faded away, leaving a pale blank surface. Write a story to catch the wise wind. You dip your quill into the bottle of ink and begin. Beside a calm oasis. Doesn't take you long to write your tale. Lay down your quill satisfied. So, our own story. Wise win. Impossible. Well, shit. Couldn't I have written it to be an easy target? All right, crew. This is too easy. There. I just fell a wheel saving throw so I can't react to it. I'm not quite sure what it is. Oh, that is bad. That's a very high level spell. Very, very deadly. 
I want to get into that acid rain. Alright, crew. Let's take it. You just follow me. Sneak attack on it, that's nice. Nice. Jesus Christ, we can't get caught in the storm of vengeance, I think it is. I'm not gonna go after it. Not into those storms. Full heal. So it's basically a high level flurry. It's not as unexpected, but. And eventually going down. 578 experience points. Why swim? Use legend lore once per day, use all wisdom once per day. Okay, and it's done. Well, Xanos did help, especially with the final boss, but Definitely more of a goddamn drag on this. Still, we've carried him throughout the entire game so far, and for the most part, he's been a great guy to have around, so I'm not going to abandon him at this point. It's a pain in the ass now, but who knows. We have a crypt and um made a tower. In the crypt that's probably fairly useful. Not sure about the made tower. Well, we'll see when the time comes. Actually, we won't be seeing it now. I'm going to go back to the slave master, sell some of my crap away, and buy healing items. I'm fairly satisfied with the healing potions I have, but we can't use them on Xanos, especially when he's unconscious. I need health, health kits. I think that's it. Maybe some spell scrolls were interred, but I don't think we can afford that. Excellent. We have ten thousand. That's worth something. Clock's eyes blade. No need. So, um, health kits. Healer's kit. Uh, it's 500 for a single one. Holy shit. At the same time, it's not like we have a lot of choice. Plus three, plus six, yeah.
leaves us with 7,000. I think I'll buy a couple of potions of clarity. Anything else? Maybe a potion of invisibility. Not for myself, but so I can turn Xanos invisible in a position where we might not want to fight all that much. Is that it? Too much. Maybe a spell scroll or two that might be useful. But the most interesting in things like summons, somewhere, some things that I can use as cannon fighter or buy time with. Dismissal wouldn't be bad. Uh, lesser spell bridge. Um, we have one. I probably wouldn't hurt to buy another one. Alternatively, we buy something on the offensive front. I think there was a minor missile storm. I'm buying another lesser spell bridge. Uh, it's a great spell. Stone skin, premonition, protection from elements. Ghostly or ethereal visage, mage armor, shadow shield, elemental shield, yeah, and reduces their spell resistance. So, with this, we can pretty much guarantee that our little sorceress friend at the end, when we mark on meter, we are able to bring down a decent number of her defenses, physical defenses and hopefully even elemental shield that would be the fire barrier that murders us she might be able to recover some of them but that's why we have two we can basically force the situation where instead of having to constantly evade her and evade the fighting because we can't do damage or we're going to be so vulnerable to anything she does we just have to evade and try to do nothing we have the items to just burst through any kind of defenses they have and then burst as much damage as possible to her and in end it there hopefully we can go through the other what the hell are they? We wise wind. Other winds. A bit faster. So. Whatever we do, we just need to reach the end, get the wind, and get the hell out. There's no real benefit to getting a level up at this point. It's not worth bothering. Loot, probably not worth bothering. Magical items could be mildly useful, but not really worth pursuing so it's all about the main objective at the moment 